Hey guys, welcome to another video of Postex. Today, we're going to show you how to use Postex's Gutenberg blob in the Elementor Builder. It will be a very quick video because it is just that simple. So let's jump right into the process. First of all, make sure that you have the Postex plugin installed and activated on your site. Postex is the number one Gutenberg based plugin to dynamically create newspaper and magazine based site or any kind of blog. Now, from your WordPress dashboard, go to the add-on section of Postex. Switch on the save template and the Elementor add-ons. Now let's create a template that we want to use. First, go to the save template section of Postex and click on the add a new template button. You can use individual Gutenberg blocks or any of Postex's block to build your template from scratch. But for this video, we could use one of Postex's starter pack template to show you the full potential of your website and save you valuable amount of time. After selecting the template, you can even customize it to your heart's content. Once we are done with the customization and our template is ready, click on the publish or the update button. Now let's start editing a page with the Elementor Builder. Once we are in the Elementor Builder, search for post text in the search bar. Drag and drop the widget where you would like it to be. And then select the save template from the drop down menu. If you are still unsatisfied with the template, you can click on the Edit Template with Gutenberg button. This will take us to the page where we can edit the template again. Once we are done with editing, we can click on the Update button. The template will be automatically updated everywhere. Now let's see how our page looks in the front end. As you can see, the starter back template has been automatically updated. So that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that bell icon so you don't miss out on upcoming videos.